Today we're at the International Harvester Club AGM. The intention was to have a working event. This TD6 and Ransom plough is just one of the machines that you would have been able to see working. Unfortunately it rained continuously for two days. With a bit of quick thinking our host came up with some alternative entertainment. and set up a drawbar dynamometer test to try out some of the tractors. The first one we're going to see is this Hydro 85 International. Interesting, the International didn't quote a drawbar horsepower for this tractor, probably because it's a Hydra. The best of three runs was 42 horsepower, which for a completely unballasted tractor was pretty good. We decided to try and check the wheel slip, and you can see here a couple of attempts at doing that. We think this tractor was at about 19% slip at the worst, which is a bit excessive. Next came the 454, 50 horsepower at the engine and a rated drawbar horsepower of 35. We managed to get 34.7 according to this rather crude test. Next up was the 444 rated at 42 engine horsepower and the drawbar horsepower of 33 we managed to get out of it something in the order of 27 the wheel slip was about 9% We'll take a short rest from the dynamometer and have a look at some of the exhibitors' tractors. Here there's a bit of adjustment going on with the front furrow width on this international plough. A wartime Farmall H and a 1960s B275. The most unusual thing on show was this uh, International 574 converted into a high clearance crop sprayer. Built in 1971 and converted into a sprayer approximately 10 years later.
one of the members here enjoying a drive on this very unusual tractor. It's time for a little bit more drawbar testing, but this time we're going to use the petrol paraffin tractors, the W6 and the W4. We flooded the W4 so we had to give it a quick tow. Watch the W6 from the seat of the John Deere dynamometer car. The ducks don't seem very impressed. Put the hydraulic pressure in the spreadsheet and out comes the drawbar horsepower. That's 29.4 for the W6. The internet tells us it was rated at 32.48. Take the W6 away and couple up the W4.
International quotes 23.7 horsepower at the drawbar for this little tractor. We manage 20.2. So in the middle of all the fun we had the AGM and the most important thing is we all got a slice of this lovely cake. If you like what you see you can join the International Harvester Club of Great Britain on the internet and don't forget to give the video a like by clicking the thumbs up button below.